Welcome back to the channel everybody. If you've read the title of this video you will know what it's about. Obviously the backdrop for this one is perfect but that was not completely intentional. But this video is about travel and why I personally think it is the best investment any business person or aspiring business person can make. And this might sound like a weird thing because travel it seems like a short term thing and it seems absolutely overpriced. And the face of it and the surface of it, it absolutely is. You know, it's expensive to get hotels, it's expensive to get flights, all of these things don't make much sense. So why would you do them and why would I say it's one of the most important things in my opinion that someone can do? I think it's for the experience that it gives. Especially for someone who's working hard whether it be on side hustles or their business, you don't really know what you're working towards until you travel. I think even if it's either you know a long stay in a far away foreign country or just a short stay somewhere local but slightly nicer like in a city like London or something like that. It's a great experience to have, especially if you go to a more affluent area. You'll see exactly what you're working towards. If you want that fancy car, it's probably out here. If you want that lovely watch, it's in some nice shop. If you want that designer piece of clothing, it's in one of the expensive shops. Everything that you may want, which is related to business, because let's face it, business is generally speaking related to finance and financial performance. Anything you want on that level is going to be out here or somewhere expensive. Now obviously alternatively if you're somebody who just wants to make a couple of hundred pounds a week or a month on a beach why not travel out to a country where you can do that and see what that lifestyle would be like. Just to live it for a week, a couple of days, it's an experience that is invaluable. And the alternative is of course well I'll save my money and I'll just go there when I get there, when I get rich enough to get there. But I do believe there is something to be said for going away, either on short city stays or again, international travel for the simple fact of you get that drive, you get to see what life could be like. Personally, I'd love to be waking up with you know views like this and all that kind of stuff, the ability to buy what I want, go where I want, do what I want, whenever I can. But that's why I believe it's important for everybody to try it at least at least once a year, it really does help you to broaden your horizons. So whilst it's expensive, we know all about the concept of investing in business. I think it is one of the best financial investments that you can get because ever since I started traveling, whether that be just on a short distance or long distances, I've realized a lot more as to what I want, what I want my life to be. I've seen what people live like. I've seen what life can be like for those who have money, those who have power, those who have influence, those who have ultimately made it. Because if you're somebody like me, who comes from a background where you don't necessarily get those opportunities, you know, handed out to you through parents or whatever, to get that just for a while, just to see what that ultra rich lifestyle is like, that ultra luxury lifestyle, this or that is the end goal. I'm not saying that's where you're going to be in a year, six months, anything like that. But then you remember what you're working towards and it allows you to get that resolve back into your life. So I think you've got to ask, what do you want from life? I think you've got to go and then experience what that would be like. And it will probably change your view on it, whether it be for the better or for the worse. Maybe you'll sit there in front of that baguette and say, actually, that's not something that I want. Or maybe you'll sit on that beach in the Philippines and say, that's exactly what I want. That's exactly where I want to live. And you'll come back and whatever you want, you'll do what it takes to get there. Because you've seen it up close. You've seen what it could be like. You've seen what you could have. And the hard work is the only thing separating you from it. So in my opinion, I would recommend traveling. I would recommend investing in travel. If you can't afford it, obviously start your business, start your side hustle, then take five days, seven days, 10 days, away from it, get out there, get where you want to be, see what you want to see, be who you want to be. It's all important in growth because that's all business is. It's learning and growth. It's an experience that we can all have. It's an experience that we must all try. The more you can learn, the more you can earn. But this in the modern world isn't necessarily related to the world of the nine to five. It's more related to what value you can add to your own business because we all know people are not getting rich by menial jobs anymore. So the question is, can you add, can you add value to your business? 
And again, when you're in a nicer place, you see efficiencies in a better way. You see how things can be run in a better manner. After all, places are nicer for a reason. There's a reason why rich people go to expensive places. It's because they're well done. It's because the businesses there run efficiently. It's because the things are there that people want. And this is oftentimes something that you can implement into your own business. So hopefully this is some food for thought. Again, whether it's going somewhere in you know Europe, Italy, Spain, something like that, going to London, something like that, whether it's you know, just a short city stay a couple of miles away. See what you want to see and experience it. Look at what life could be like and hopefully it will give you some more inspiration and more resolve to work on your businesses when you get back. Thank you for watching this short video and I hope to see you again soon.